Hey everybody, it's Kenny with the Natural State Gardener again. As you've probably seen if you've watched a few of our other videos, you know that we've got a few yard hens. Um, and they've, we've had them about 14 weeks and it's really time they started laying. Of course, our weather's cold, it's getting cold now, so they typically slow down in the winter time anyway. But uh, I need to do something tonight that I've been intending to do for a long time and I've just not done it. I should have done it weeks ago. And that's building uh, some laying boxes. We've got shelving, we've got stuff out there they could lay in, but they really need their own boxes so they can feel secure to go in and lay. I think maybe part of the reason we're not getting more eggs, we've got one egg out of all five of, well, actually there are four hens. We've gotten one egg out of them uh, since we've had them. And that was last week, the middle of last week. So they really should be laying. So we're gonna build this nesting box and uh, I call it a chicken condo. Um, we're gonna build five slots, four or five slots, uh, the way I'm going to build it, I'm not going to have a bottom in it because we're going to set this up on a shelf. There's a shelf in our chicken coop, which our chicken coop actually was just a storage shed at one time. And there's a wide shelf on one side and we're just going to lay it directly on top of that, put our nesting material in there and use that. And whenever it's time to clean it, it'll be real simple to clean. All we'll have to do is slide it off that shelf and everything will fall right onto the tarp. So that's the way I'm going to build it. The way I'm going to do I'm going to build one foot cubes. Uh, there's going to be 12 by 12 by 12, 12 wide, 12 deep, 12 tall. If you get any wider than that, you really don't want it much wider than that because, the, you know, they, they, they want to feel secure. They want to feel like they're in a smaller place. And a lot of times if you build them any bigger, sometimes your hens will want to, you know, lay together. And we don't want that. We want them all to lay in their own box. So the way I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it on the cheap. Um, I know everybody, you know, is on a budget and we're no different than anybody else. Uh, we're going to, I'm, I'm building it out of pallets that I found. Um, I've got um, a friend of mine that is the manager out here at our local Harbor Freight and they have a bunch of pallets and he said take all of them that you want because we just have to throw them away, they're in our way. So we've been picking up pallets, we're going to use the lumber out of these pallets to build these laying boxes. This is a piece of Harbor, of uh, Hardy board that we had left over from our uh, remodel in our house. We've got some more over there, so I'm gonna use this for the back. It's a little bit heavy, but I think it'll be okay to go back. Pay no attention to our drawing. That means absolutely nothing. Because Christine and I either one are artists. Okay, first thing I'm gonna do, and I've kinda already got started here. Um, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna build just a basic frame um, we've got, uh, I'm going to build these on 12 inch centers. Actually, it's about 13 and a half, uh, so that we'll have our true 12, 12 inches in there. And then these are 13 inches tall, so they'll be a little taller than they are deep and wide, but that's okay. When, I mean, this is not, we're not building the Taj Mahal here. We're building the, the Chick Mahal, I guess you could say. So anyway, um, I've got these done. I'm going to go ahead and measure over 13 inches, so that'll give us four one two, three, they give us four, four holes out of this one box. And that should really be plenty. Um, we've only got four hens. We can always build more as we need them. Uh, so right now, what I'm gonna do, I've already pre-cut these so that, now the two of fours, um, we found uh, somebody was tearing down some old fencing and we got these two of fours from the side of the road from that. No, actually, I think my cousin had those, didn't she? That came from my picket fence. Ah, that's right. We had a picket fence. That by, we, the by the right chicken right. condo building. Your bird right. condos. Right, 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 right. So anyway, um, and like I say, it's all repurposed, recycled material. So you don't have to spend any money. The most expensive thing you're going to have is nails or screws. So uh, let me go ahead and see if I can find my tape. Uh... Does Daniel not have any for 